Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Lisa, and I'm here to share a word from Lori Lahan Kaiser. The title is, This is an Informational War. And this word was posted November 1st, 2022. I was just given this word from the Holy Spirit while in prayer. I am your God, and you are my children. Many have said, there is no God. Many think that I am irrelevant, outdated, or cannot see or cannot hear. I assure you, I am not blind or deaf. I know what evil the enemy has planned, and I will only allow so much. I know what goes on in the hearts of man, and I know the wickedness that has fallen on the earth. Take heart, my children. All these things must come to pass before I can return. The storm is upon you, but if you make me your anchor, you will survive the storm. Although your ship may become torn and tattered, I will anchor you. Hold fast. Behold, I come quickly. I will give you comfort in these end days. I will bring you rest. I will give you peace that passes all understanding. Those who do not know me will not understand this peace I give. They will ask, Why are you not concerned about the world crumbling around us? But it's not, because you don't care. It is my peace in your heart and mind, this peace within you, will perplex the enemy. Hold fast to it. All your trust needs to be in me. World War III has begun, although most are not aware of it. It started in Kiev. They do not call it World War III because truth is not in them. Parts of this war will be unconventional and not fought like wars of the past. This is an informational war. This is a technology war. The technology used by the enemy is very distorted and not true. The enemy will have videos and say, You must believe what you have seen. It is all captured on video. But this will also be an illusion of the enemy. Do not believe their words or their proof. Stay quiet and watch their actions and their fruits. The enemy within is great. There will be more tre treasonous acts come to light. I will bring their evil plans and works to light. They will cower and run in fear. I will cut them off. They run toward the darkness. They desire the darkness but my children must run toward the light. I am the light. Run to me, and I will shelter you. Some of you look toward man to save you. Man cannot save you. Only I can save you. I will pour out my wisdom and discernment on all my children who ask for it. My children will need supernatural wisdom and discernment in these days, so they will not be ensnared in the evil one's devices. What seems right to man will not be right in my eyes. Stay in constant prayer and keep your eyes on me and hide my word within your hearts. And that is the end of this message. I pray you all have a beautiful day in the Lord. God bless each and every one of you. And I will see you either next video or in the air. Bye-bye.